find out how this new eco development is changing things up and expanding the future of the Ortigas CBD. This is Ortigas East. Listen. Did you know that 50 billion is being invested to radically transform the Tiendecitas area into Ortigas East, a 16 hectare eco estate? The term was first used in South Africa for developments with large green spaces that help environmental conservation. In the Philippines, Google the term eco-estate and you will get this. That's because 40% of the development is reserved for nature. With parklets, tree-lined roads, and open spaces. Their goal is to also minimize carbon emissions with bike and pedestrian trails. This is also the first development under the partnership between Ortigas and Company, Ayala Land, and SM Prime. So it should be something to keep an eye on. Ortigas East is near schools, malls, and other institutions. Not to mention the planned C5 MRT station around here. Because it's connected to Julia Vargas, it is considered to be an extension of the Ortigas Business District with its own hotel, a full-scale mall, and several office towers. The first of which is called the Glaston. They are also planning to improve traffic and transportation along C5 with a six-lane boulevard and a multi-mode transport terminal. Living in the Eco Estate is made possible thanks to three residential condominiums called the Verdant Towers. The three buildings are connected by a common commercial podium and amenity level designed for fitness, lounging, and play. The first of the three towers to rise is the Maple Tower with 42 residential floors. They offer a studio, one bedroom, and two-bedroom units. It is expected to be turned over by 2024. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Daniel Alieje. Please join me as I create original content to make real estate investing fun. Did you enjoy the video? Please do like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Thank you.